We right now in the studio have an amazing and inspiring story this morning. You've got to hear this. I'm sitting next to a blind Paralympic athlete. This is Sean Cheshire. She's here from Fort Lauderdale and you just set the Guinness World Record at the Grand Canyon. I am amazed by you. I'm inspired by you. And tell me what made you say I'm going to do this? Oh, I so I'm a cyclist for the mm -hmm. USA paracycling team. I was injured at a training camp and I haven't been able to race due to the severe concussion that um, I got. And I went to a women's retreat in June, first time at the Grand Canyon. I've never seen it before, when I, uh, before I lost my vision. And it was incredibly hard, very difficult. And I was like, wow, this sucks. <laughs> and so I- So you wanted more. So I was like, I gotta come back and I've gotta conquer the canyon. And uh, we That's did a little great. research. Blind woman has never uh, completed the crossing. Um, and a blind gentleman's record was like 28 hours. I was like, all right, we gotta beat that. You're, and you said, I'm yeah. gonna kill it. I said, Not so just we're just gonna it. go out and crush it. Yeah, let's yeah. show pictures. We've got some amazing pictures and video. Um, you hiked day and night. And tell us, you kind of went, uh, is it called rim to rim? Rim to rim to rim. So we, we hiked the, from the South uh, Kaibab Trail, down the canyon, across the canyon, up the North Kaibab Trail, back down again across the canyon and back up the, si the South Kaibab Trail, That's 42 miles. Unbelievable, you've got a guide in front of you and a guide behind you helping. And you know, I was asking you earlier, have you always been this great athlete? And you said you really started getting into d just, I can do anything after you lost your eyesight. I think that um, losing my vision after being sighted my entire life was such a catastrophic loss that I struggled uh, to even really have the will to live. And so, uh, giving myself the challenge of becoming an elite athlete, which is very hard, uh -huh. um, gave myself purpose uh, to get out of bed and to take care of myself. And I've, I've kind of just evolved into, now that I've taken care of myself, now I want to take this traumatic loss and help others. And I think and you are. You're, I hope so. <laughs> you're hiking, you're cycling. We're showing yeah. more pictures right now. You were in the Paralympics in 2016. Uh, yeah. Yes. I mean, it's it's unbelievable. The things you, I feel like you've done more since you lost your vision than even possibly before, right? Yes. I'm a completely different person. Uh -huh. I take nothing for granted. I live every day to its fullest. And... Um, I wish I had been like that when I could see. I was not though, unfortunately. Well, I know everybody tells you all the time, everything happens for a reason. That's right. And you are making a difference in so many people's lives who are just sitting around today saying, <laughs> I need to do more. So thank you so much for coming in and talking thank to you us. For me. And congratulations on your Guinness World Record. Thank you very much. Oh, awesome. <laughs>